Welcome to our wrap-up video for November and December, our last one for 2020. My name's Oliver, and you're welcome to call me Ollie. In this video, we'll tell you all about the great work we've done on our Business Intelligence module, our B2B module, and our core Unleash functions. Business Intelligence Enhancements We've been working hard to enhance the Business Intelligence module. These enhancements are exclusive to BI Vision users and will give you much more dynamic and responsive views of your data. Improved data filtering. Refine your results even further and get the data you're really after with these new enhancements. Within the menu of each dimension, you can now search and select multiple items to quickly choose or filter out items to view more specific results. Refine your view even further with custom date option in your date menu. Select a custom date range and see year-on-year -year comparison of your key metrics. Unit quantity KPI and sales context. You now see a new KPI for total sales by unit quantity. Choose a metric across salespeople, products, regions, and more to drill down on sales performance by unit sold. That's it for BI. Over to you, Bruno. Thanks, Oli. I'm Bruno, and I'm going to talk about all the great work we released on the B2B store. Those enhancements have been put in place so you can make the B2B store truly yours and also you can delight your customers. Display stock levels on your B2B store. You can now choose how to display the stock availability in your B2B store. Your customers will be able to see the stock more efficiently when navigating your stores. They're going to be available into multiple places including your product detail page view and your category view including the list and grid views. And if you are in the Premium or the Premium Plus store and you have multiple warehouses, you can choose to display the stock across multiple warehouses. Display estimated date of arrival for out-of-stock items. Choose whether you'd like to display the estimated date of arrival of out-of-stock products. Your customers will be able to better factor in the estimated lead time for out-of-stock products. This could retain some sales that may have been lost because of the unknown lead time. And now this concludes all the enhancements around the B2B store. And now to you, Debbie. Thank you, Bruno. Last but certainly not least, let's talk about the enhancements to the core Unleashed functions. We've reduced repetitive manual processes, introduced automation and streamlined workflows. Customized statuses for sales orders. If you have large teams or longer, more complex sales cycles, this feature is for you. This feature allows you to create custom statuses for your sales orders. Your teams can see at a glance what stage an order is at and what they need to prioritize. Customized statuses for assemblies. Create custom statuses for your assemblies so you can drill down on specific statuses, making it so much easier to see your specific manufacturing processes and which stage each assembly is at. Share report layout. You can now share report grid views with other Unleashed users by ticking the shared box. Import and export assemblies. If you've enabled assemblies in your account, this enhancement will allow you to import and export your assemblies and bulk update them too. Better manage sales shipments. Create invoices and dispatch shipments in bulk. You can also auto-assign the oldest serial and batch numbers for shipments, all from the shipment screen. You can also bulk process multiple shipments at the same time perfect for a fast-paced business. There are more enhancements coming soon. Keep an eye out for the ability to generate new assemblies from the reorder report, create credits through the API, and more. Visit the Feature Enhancements page to learn more about all the enhancements we've talked about today. While you're there, let us know what you think by rating the enhancements. We hope you have a great end to your year. See you in 2021 with our next wrap-up video.